welcome to our channel this is abacus child learning application hello friends in previous video we learned about single digit of numbers in this video we are start learning about two digit of numbers let's start before start let's see some basic tips of abacus when you start all of the bits should be up in the top row and down in the bottom row the second farthest column on the right side would be the tens place on second row the upper bit indicate the value of 50 and the bottom bit indicate the value of 10 let's see some example so we get more idea here we have number of 10 so let's set Ten. For ten, we have to move one bead to upward from bottom on row two, and row is tens column. Go to next example. We have to reset the abacus. For reset the abacus, we have to press top right button. So let's reset and continue. Here we have number of forty. So let's set forty. For forty, we have to move four beads to upward from bottom on tens column. Let's reset and go to next number. Here we have number of fifty. So let's set fifty. For fifty, we have to move top bead to downward on tens column. It's easy, right? Let's see one more example on row two. Here we have number of eighty. So let's set eighty. Can you guess which bits we have to move? For eighty, we have to move three bits to upward from bottom and move top bit to downward from top on row two. Here we got the number eighty. It's simple. Let's see some more example of two digit of numbers on row one and row two. Here we have number twenty three. So let's set twenty three. For twenty three, we have to set three on row one and set twenty on tens column, or we can say row number two. Let's first move three beads to upward from bottom. On first row, and now move two beads to upward from bottom on second row, and here we got the twenty-three. Let's reset and go to next number. Here we have number forty-six. So let's set forty-six. For forty-six, here we have to set six on first row and set forty on second row. Let's move one bead to upward from bottom below the beam on row one. Now move top bead to downward above the beam on same row one. And now move four beads to upward from bottom on second row. And here we are done. Let's see one more example. And here we have number seventy-five. So let's set seventy-five. Anyone can guess? Okay. So for seventy-five, first we have to set five on row one. So for five, we have to move top to downward on first row above the beam. Now for seven, first we have to move two beat to upward. From bottom below the beam on row two, and now move top bead to downward above the beam on row two, and finally we set the seventy-five. Yeah, it's easy, right? Yeah. Thank you for watching the video. For practice of abacus, download the application from Google Play Store. Link is available in description. Subscribe the channel to get alert for upcoming a video.
Thank you.